Welcome back to the channel guys, today I'll be playing some more Cyberpunk 2077. It has dawned on me that I've never played the game without ray tracing, so it's more of a test for me, but you guys will more likely be interested to see how the game performs. Uh, so I'm just going to quickly go through the in-game settings now. I'm playing at a resolution of 3840 by 2160. Uh, film granted chromatic aberration I keep off, that's my own personal choice, doesn't really affect performance. Everything else I've left on high or ultra. Now what I have done is disable ray tracing completely, that's kind of the point of this video. But I've also left DLSS in quality mode on because I've got the DLSS 2.2 .2 mod enabled as well. So honestly, it looks like native 4K and it gives you about 20 FPS boost, which is very welcome in such a demanding game. So let's get into it. I've just got to wait a little bit because um, I'm waiting for a mission to start, so I think we need to wait. Judy, so, you got a plan? Damn right I do. Come over to mine tonight. Gonna lay the groundwork with Tom and Roxy. They're with us. Michael will be here too. How'd you manage that? Got something really big. Tell you everything tonight. Last thing, what do you like on your pizza? Let's go for the pepperoni locust, locust shall pepperoni. We? And lots of extra cheese. Atta boy. So, I'll see you come evening? Of course I'll be there. Okay, let's make our way back to Night City. So I'm kind of in the Badlands at the moment. So here, performance isn't really too... Well, it's not, it is demanding. It always is, but it's not as demanding as Night City. So getting over 70 frames a second now but it's not a true reflection on what could possibly happen so let's, let's get back to Night City and see how it goes let's put the radio on as it's just ridiculously quiet flight there. So I've noticed there's a lot of um, graphics cards coming back in stock so if anyone's after an RTX 3080 Ti you might actually have better luck than you think because they're occasionally in stock throughout the day which I've noticed. So um, if you're interested in buying one of those cards you may have better luck than you think. Seems that the mining boom's really simmering down now so let's hope stock returns to normal and everyone who wants a card that's been waiting can actually go and get one now. This is my turning. What happens when you start trying to look at your on-screen display when you're meant to be playing a game? Honestly, when I'm playing personally, I don't even have my on-screen display up. So if that's what you're wondering, should I be used to it? No, I, I never have my on-screen display on when I'm generally playing the game. But I really hate this song. I'm just going to turn the radio off now. Getting all the rubbish songs now that I've started to record, usually get some better songs than that. No, pretty much back in Night City now. Still in the mid-70s, so looking good so far. Now the road looks completely different without ray tracing, so Ray tracing on this game is certainly noticeable. So if I can hit my top speed, this can do about 200 miles per hour. One of my favorite cars in the game. It'll set you back about 115,000 if you want it. You want trouble? At least I didn't kill anyone. Once you go off, once you take air, there's nothing you can do to really control yourself. Anyway, let's try and hit that top speed. It's always a car that goes past that mess. Massive frame spike there as well. Almost 
almost hit 200. Look out! I was looking out. So Night City is pretty big as you can see there is definitely need for a vehicle. If you want to try and get around this place on foot, you'll be taking a lot of time. Like the game feels futuristic in parts, but most of the time it feels really, really slummy depending on what area you are. So they've done a great job of kind of segregating the rich areas and the poor areas. You can really, really feel the difference. Anyway, still managing to get around 70 frames per second. So I'm happy with it so far. Let's we'll see how what Judy's got in store for us. Remember the first time I played this game, I tried to romance Judy, but he's just not interested in guys, unfortunately. But at least you get Pan Am, so I guess they're gonna give you everything. Come on in. Pizza's getting cold. V, hey, my reconnaissance is complete. It worked. I can hear it in We're your in voice. The kitchen. Everything is ready. I am sending you coordinates. Join me as quickly as you can. You made it. Good. Grab a seat. This is Roxanne. She's worked at Clouds longer than any of us. Hello. Hey, nice to meet you. When I heard what you pulled at Clouds, shit, I so regretted I was off that day. Just eat the free pizza and then we're out of here, okay? Feeling better? You look better. I'm on autopilot. I don't think. Just do. Sound method. So then, what's the plan? Need to wait for Michael. You'll never get rid of the stench of the corpse. You drop a lot of them, don't you? What's your secret? It suddenly comes naturally to you, doesn't it? Yeah, odd. Given how much work I gotta put into it. By the way, Boris didn't show up for work today. Or yesterday. No shit, I wonder why. I got sick, maybe. We hit the lottery jackpot. Bought himself a ticket to the moon. Hmm, could be anything. Done saying hello to each other? Revolution won't plan itself. I modified the behavioral chip. It can equip any doll with a motor reflex system. In other words, make the doll move and fight like a preem tier solo. Fascinating, isn't it? What one can learn while tuning fake orgasms for the moxes. Mind stepping outside? Can't smoke in here. You'll air it out later. Fine, I'll sit by the window. The body will react as if executing a well-trained series of movements. Already tested it out on top. Chip's impulses supplant any natural reflexes, so it'll make users feel like they're experiencing cyberpsychosis. But it's basically the same as when we activate ourselves for a client. Tech that's all pros and no cons, I don't buy it. Side effects, spill them. Combat mode auto-initiates when a threat is present, and uh, there's no way to stop it. Can't find a workaround. And that's it. I don't know. Only way to determine that would be through months of testing on a range of subjects. There's an ethical side, too. You could murder someone and not remember a thing. It's pretty messed up. Solo skills don't lie in just executing movements. There's split second processes that happen logistics, decision making, result of years of practice. Doubt your chip's capable of compensating for that. You're probably right. 
But I don't see another way. Alternatives intensive training, but we don't have time for that. Uh, how'd you ever come up with this? Learned how the behavioral chip works at Clouds. Always seemed like they must be pretty easy to modify. I'm surprised I didn't get the idea the moment we walked into Michael's office. Count yourself lucky. What with all the cams and mics and clouds? Tiger Claws would sooner dig those chips out of the dolls with screwdrivers than let an idea like this run its course. All right. Gotta see it to believe it. Finally. Someone said it. Tom? Okay, guess well, we have a demonstration in order. Kung Fu training virtue. Okay. Gotta admit, not bad. Yeah, for the market square in Kabuki. Uh, before we start talking serious biz, gonna need to see serious action. You just saw him. I saw a bar trick. I want to see a fight. Got an expert in causing bodily harm among us. I want to see how Tommy handles him. V? Okay. See what you got. Don't mess up my digs, okay? I like it here. Hey, son, now! What the? Ah! Are you there? Can you hear me? <laughs> Look at me go! You see that? Woo! Nice work, you gotta do some cardio. Outdid yourself. If you were to sell that, you'd be the richest Judy in the NUSA. Please, plenty of killing machines in the world. I don't want to turn more people into them. After this, chips are getting micro nuked. Okay, okay. That probably sells it. The chip works. Let's get to it then. You've got an elite force of three muscle heads and a techie. What now? Guards and tiger claws in and around will overpower. Take down, disarm, escort them out. Clouds will be ours. Bosses, we'll give an ultimatum. A cut of the proceeds in exchange for never showing their faces at the club again. And having no say in how the club's managed. That's what I thought. A half-baked, insane plan. You can't see more than an inch ahead of you. Taking out the security there won't solve anything. Claws will just send more. Hiromi Sato is the man you gotta get to. Hiromi Sato. Who's that? Cloud's real boss. He rarely shows, but you can't so much as sneeze without him finding out. Claws trust him, respect his opinion. He is one of them. We can try to convince him, but it's doubtful. We stand a better chance by injecting him with a dose of fear. Where do we find this, Hiromi? At his apartment, H8 Mega Tower, topmost floor. It's a penthouse, almost never steps outside its glass walls. But I'll figure out a way to get us inside. It's just my work. If we get him in his apartment, where he thinks he's completely safe, bosses will understand what we're looking to demonstrate. My, my. There's a flickering in that skull sponge of yours after all. So how about it, V, Tom, Roxy? Made up your minds? I... I need to think about it. I've never wasted anyone before, you know? I'm with it all the way. V? Don't tell me you're seriously considering this. Sticking our precious necks out for a bunch of whores? Count me in, Judy. I already said I'd help, didn't I? Thanks, V. Save the gratitude for later, please. Ah, I'll set. set to meet with Hiromi and let you know. I need a couple days. Have fun. Toodaloo. Michael, hold up. Give us a lift. Only if you don't talk to me. I feel a migraine coming on. Oh, shit. I'm scared, V. Speaking of gratitude, stuff I'm asking you to do, well, usually comes with a price tag, I know. You want to help, I get that. But I'm more than happy to pay your fee in full. Feels like it's only right. Judy? For real? No, don't want to hear it. 
But you... Beb, Beb, Beb. Not a word. Uh, v, everything okay? V, you don't look so hot. Uh, uh, okay. Okay, I'm better. Uh, fine. What the hell, V? You, like, sick? Remember the heist Evelyn hired us for? The relic I was gonna collect. Couldn't forget that in a million years. That biochip. Well, long story short, it had Johnny Silverhand's mind on it. An engram of it that's overriding my mind. You being serious? Truly wish I wasn't. Fuck. Anything at all you can do? One can hope. It's late. You're tired. You can crash on my couch if you want. Let's be going. Suit yourself. I'll hollow you once Maiko set up to meet with Hiromi. I'm gonna wait till morning and see what other missions I can be doing. It's a bit better. So, you do get like NPCs that send messages and stuff like that. Um, so yeah. so. Okay, and you can respond to messages as well. No more missions here anyway. Right, might as well go meet Takamura. So far so good. Even in Night City in the rain. Still holding over 16, which is decent. There are a lot of uh, frame spikes here and there, though. That's a bit new. Just about got across before the cars came. I was gonna be able to squeeze through all of them, but the cars up front definitely wasn't in a space there.
Nakamura was a long way out, to be honest. That hit someone. <laughs> Okay, talk to Mara, where have you gone? Excellent timing. How'd your recon go? I believe I have collected enough to try. The complex is well guarded, but we should manage. The floats stand in the main warehouse. Your task is simple, to get inside. Oh, how? The more quiet, the better. But you are the thief. I will not question your skills. Once there, you must locate the largest platform and infect its system. Where are you gonna be? I will create a diversion. They should not discover our intentions. Do you know what Arasaka despises the most confuses them? When communication fails, when they cannot talk to each other, they are first to cry. Sabotage. I'll be in touch. Okay, so you drove it all the way out here. I was gonna say, if I didn't have to do the mission now, I'd have been pissed. Okay, so I got a break in here. Just make sure my silence is on. I'm gonna have to end up shooting one or two people. Except if there's any CCTV and it's a knockout. Some turret or something, I'll turn it off. I actually turned it on. Right, so. CCTV can turn this off. leave it down here hopefully no one sees it okay let's keep it moving more guards I'll go down with that. This revolver is so powerful. We'll take your head clean off, no problem. Should really move the body. Put it over here. Camera. 
wonder if we can get in through this way. Got some guards over here. May as well take care of them. Take care of these cameras. Not sure if this guy will survive. He's got a lot of armor on him. Best take out this guy first. This guy as well. Yeah, no problem. Okay, so far, so good. useful. I'm taking care of most of security though. Okay, let's find a way into this base. Where is that big mech I gotta worry about? Deactivate that. Just pick this body up, can't leave it here. Oh, can't, can't just leave it right there. That's the stuff. Okay, that's about as much as I can conceal it. Got that mech over here. I don't know how strong it is. I could probably destroy it, but I don't want to take my chances. There's another camera over here. Let me just take this out. Let's get out of here. things that you're in. Good. I will reach the control room and make a terrible mess. Very well. I am ready. When you finish, I'll make the system sick. Okay, how do I get through this door without causing an alarm? Someone over there as well. Okay, probably not the best way to get in. I'll find another way. This guy, no problem. We love the way their head does goes pop. So, is there anything I can do to minimize security? Let's turn this off. Okay, so we can access the surveillance system, which I've been able to turn off. That helps. Oh, it's just one second too quick. Too slow. They know there's a problem, but they haven't actually seen me, so I still have a chance. So much for being uh, covert. I know you're in here. I can feel it. You 
Second gun. Screw it. I'm just gonna kill everyone. Take you guys out one by one, no problem. Don't worry, I'm not hiding. Okay, if the enemies have been alerted, because I've pretty much killed them all anyway. Okay, let's get into the float. I'll blow this virus. Floats are to do with as we please. Fly to Tokyo if you want. I just may do that. Good luck. Now it is my turn. Can you see? The roof kills. Even the roof is slowly. Me, the roof. That is your will. There are buildings around. Smaller ones. Use them to come down. V, you must hurry. An Arasaka heavy approaches. Get it out of there. Fucking worked. Excellent work, V. Okay. What now? Now we retreat into the shadows and arm ourselves with patience. I will contact you before the parade. Until then, try not to get into any more trouble. As if I wasn't in enough already. Okay. I've got to do some other stuff while Takamura does his thing. Another job there. So we'll look at my journal. So I can go to this fight in Pacifica. Why not? May as well do that. Not got anything else to do. But yeah, performance has been good so far, so no complaints. Because they're far away, that's gonna be a long drive. Oh, some radio on. Hopefully, they're playing a better song. Oh, this song again.
Unfortunately, with the radio, you can't actually skip songs. They really should have added that feature in there. A tent. You are One day you will be fired. Is that why you're here? Oh, it's this guy. Hey! Ha ha ha! What a coincidence! So it's you I'm fighting. Depends. On what? If you want to get splattered. If so, then lace up, lay down some cash, and let's have some fun. Yeah, why not? Let's do it. If we're doing this, it's for serious scratch. I'm up in the stakes. Oh, I see you're not joking around. No problem. I'll sweeten the pot. Come with me. This man's a bit of a weirdo. Punch him right in that grenade of a nose that he's got. You two are ready to start? Yeah, ready as I'll ever be. May the best brawler win! He went up. Come on, man. Too slow. Finish you off. Stop! I'm done! I surrender. This fight is over. V is the winner. Ooh, that, uh, that was a doozy, V. Got me grinning like a goon, ear to ear. Here's your take. You earned every any. Thanks. You're a real bozo. You know that, Ozob. A what? And you're Mr. Normal. Don't turn your nose up at me. <laughs> hey, you do know that grenade's gonna pop one of these days, right? I avoid it, but someone else. I know, I know. We all die someday. At least when I do, there'll be fireworks. That's crazy. Who the hell are these guys? you get for your troubles. Let's check my journal, see what else I can do. So yeah, there's really nothing for me to do. I've pretty much done 
all the missions that are available. Okay. I guess I'll leave it there, guys. So it's just a glimpse of how the game performs without ray tracing at 4K. And for me, it performs very, very well. Very, very smooth. I haven't got too many complaints. It's definitely a lot more playable. So for those who don't like ray tracing, you ain't really got an excuse if you've got this type of setup. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.